All right, you're watching DefenseReview.com. We are here at the CMMG booth, and we have Tyson Bradshaw here, and he's going to show us this new M47 Mutant, which is essentially an AR uh, in AK format, essentially, or an AK in AR format, rather. Yeah, correct. So, uh, so here we go. All right, well, it's kind of a, a blend of both, obviously. Um, okay. you know, other manufacturers have tried and failed. You know, we decided to uh, take it and knock it out of the park, so we've addressed all the issues. You know, we've upgraded the bolt to our 308 style, right. so it's large, it's beefy, it's going to withstand everything instead of failing like the uh, AR-15 style. We've also addressed the magazines. It takes AKs, which are known to be reliability. Um, known to be reliable. Um, it'll take any standard AK mag magazine right. in addition to drum mags. Um, obviously, you still have all the familiar AR controls, buttstock, pistol grip. You can change out any of the triggers, safety, all that's, all that's standard. Um, the other nice thing is the mag drops free very easily. Rock and lock just like everything else. MSRP from 1500 to 1850. And the mag release is a push button forward. Yeah, push correct. Forward. Yep. Push forward. You do it real quick. Damn. Yeah, Ow. just like that. Okay. It also weighs Ready? less than an AK-47. It's 7.2 pounds. We have three configurations. Obviously, one is standard. Let's get it up a little bit just sure. so you can yeah, see it a little bit better. It's hard to. This light is really tricky. Here, I'll get over. This is better. So, okay. all right. Keep all right. going. So there it is, you know, we've uh, obviously maintained a, a free flow key mod handguard like we do on the rest of our models. This one's actually our 308 handguard, so any other DPMS style one will, will fit. So that's the gist of it, you know, we got uh, billet, um, brand new this billet upper and lower this receivers. Section, this receiver section is interesting to me. Yeah, you bet, you know, because we basically, we added the girth of the 308, but we shortened it down to a mid-sized receiver, so it's about the length of an AR-15. Right, I mean, it just looks really strong back there. You betcha, yeah, it is, it, that's what we've done. We've tried to, you know, engineer it so that it's, you know, built for the round as opposed to stuffing in a platform where it doesn't belong. So uh, we're pretty excited about it, and we're looking at some new caliber and some other exciting stuff in, in the following in the year. And right, and this, is brand, this is brand new. Brand new. 7.62 yeah. by 39 millimeter. You betcha. And Very we're cool. already shipping them. Have so. you guys thought about doing 5.45? We sure have. You know, there's a lot of other calibers on the table that, that don't necessarily fit an AR platform. And, uh, you know, we're looking to uh, see what we can do about shoehorning it in this thing and, and make sure it, it works well. Well, thank you very much. I really hey, appreciate no it. Thanks for All right, by. CMMG booth and Mutant, I'm sorry, M Mark 47 Mutant, and you are watching DefenseReview.com.